Hello Shining Ones, Magus here on a beautiful day in Asha. If you're brand new to the channel, we are Zoroastrians, we are the Magi. And one of our wonderful friends in the comments asked if I would do a, a video on prayer. And I would love to share with you our two most powerful Zoroastrian prayers, Hashem Vahu and Yatah Ahu. And my friends, here's what's said of these powerful prayers. It's a primordial utterance of such a nature that if all the corporal world should learn it and hold fast by it, they would be redeemed from their mortality. My, my friends, if we can hold the energy, the frequency, the spirit of these prayers, you can do anything. And, and so if you got your book, we're going to be in Asha 3 today. Asha 3 says, I have Vohu Menu. That's the God mind. That, that's where you and God are one, that divine spark in you. It, it comes from the light. It's made of the light. My friends, it's a light that runs out darkness. It's a love so pure that hate, fear, and greed cannot live in it. And when you are this, my friends, that is your prayer because you, you hold the light. You hold the love. Asha 3 says, my only job is to align with and hold continuously in my mind, the attributes of God, right? The Christ said, verily, verily, I say unto you, he who holds my word has God life. There, there's no begging a deity in the sky. There, there's no deals or bets you can make. You know, I'll, I'll stop doing this. God, if you'll do this for me, or I'll start doing this. If you'll do this for me, the only thing we can do, our only job is to align and hold. It's all about holding that, that frequency because frequency and energy makes form and matter. And that's the only way. There's nothing else. My friends, you can't buy your way into a miracle. You have to attune yourself. I have the Christ mind. I have Vohum in you. That, that idea that God and I are one. My only job is to align with and hold continuously in mind the attributes of God, love, life, peace, joy, power, and freedom, and to be those attributes. My friends, you got to be God good to live in God good. You have to match that frequency to, so that you can live in God and God good can live in you where you are, are, you are one. So, so you have to be the peace. You have to be the love. You have to be the joy. It says, my mind, my vohu menu, my divine spark, who I truly am, is God, but my thoughts are not always God. And here's our, our, our prayer. May my thoughts align with the God mind. How do we do that, right? How do we pray? We attune ourselves. That is our prayer. So, Yata'ahu. It's said of this prayer, when one third is prayed, your enemies and the evil spirit shudder with fear. When two thirds is prayed, the evil spirit falls to his knees. And when the prayer is finished, your enemies are vanquished. The evil spirit is pushed out uh, uh, of your atmosphere, my friends, because darkness can't live in the light. And, and so I, I want to tell you what it means first, and, and then we'll pray it. It's, it says in English, just as the Lord wills, so the priestly king in consciousness of Asha. You have to know what Asha is. Uh, Asha is the only thing that could come from a perfect creator's perfect mind. It's perfection. It's good. It's bliss. It's love. It's unmixed. Zoroaster means pure starlight. That pure light, it, it's not one of those gods that came after the original monotheistic religion, right? Those gods that came that love and hate, right? They're mixed. They, they can be at peace, our war. They, they can heal our sin disease. My, my, my friends, the original god of the original, original religion was just good, pure light. So we have to know what Asha is. Asha is the perfect creator's perfect idea, the only thing that could come from him. And my friends, there's a little secret right there. That the magic of the Magi works in reason. Our reason to believe is what I just said right there. The only thing a perfect creator could create is perfection, Asha. And, and that gives us a reason to believe it. Say, that's what's real. That's what's substance. That's what I'm going to hold on to, the frequency. Uh, be in the love, be in the peace, be in the joy, because that's what's real. Everything else is lie and illusion. So just as the Lord will, so the priestly king in consciousness of Asha. We have consciousness of Asha now. The gift of Vohumenu, right? Is that Christ mind, that knowing that you and God are one, and now all activity comes from wisdom of that word incarnate, right? The, the original word of Asha is now, it's in you, it is you, you're holding it, and all activity, all thoughts, words, and deeds are coming from, from this 
original word. What's the original word? Only good comes from God and no evil comes from him. From that original word, our spiritual world is made straight and then our material world comes into order. That's our prayer, my friend. You're asking me to teach you how to pray? That's how you pray, right there. It says the good shepherd brings the government of Ahura Mazda, that all good spirit, and Asha is actualized. And so now I want to pray in the original tongue, this powerful prayer. Yata uhu vario, atara tush, ashat chitacha, vangush dazda manango, shatana mangush mazdai, shartremchai uhurai, ayim dregubio, dot dot vasterem. Oh, can you feel it? Can you feel the darkness flee? As you're holding that light, just the frequency of those original words of the original religion, my friends, of the original idea, Asha, such power in it. The evil spirit can't stand in this atmosphere. Hashem Vahu, it's an invocation of Asha, that very Holy Spirit of God, my friends. And we do right because we are right. We speak right. We think right because we've become it. We hold that frequency. Hashem vahu vashastemasti ushtaasti ushtaamai yatishai vestai Hashem. Come, Holy Spirit, Asha, be actualized. You are welcome here. Beautiful Spirit of the all good God. We love you and we thank you and we honor you. And Asha is. If you enjoyed this, let me know. Go to the comments. Hit that like button. And know I love, love, love you.